Hi everyone, welcome back for another tutorial. In this tutorial I want to show you how to use macro keys on a, a gaming uh, keyboard from Corsair to assign shortcut keys to using Photoshop. So I'm using the IQ program, basically it's the Corsair program that you can control lights and other stuff. So I've got under my devices, I'm going to double click right here. So now I have actions. So basically I've got I'm going to delete any action and I'm going to click plus and I want to assign G1 so there you go as you can see right here G1 and I have macro text media launch application so first I want to launch the application so in this case I want to use it this macro key to open Photoshop so I'm just going to find the path so I'm going to this PC local disk program files adobe photoshop cc 2019 and i'm going to click here if you're using a mac go to your applications folder and it's there so click open and there you go so now advanced settings retain original key output it's fine as it is and start settings cool so now if i click i'm just going to minimize this if i'll click g1 opens photoshop so now I have Photoshop open. Now I want to assign some keys. So first I'm going to bring an image. Uh, so I'm just going to bring an image like so. And I'm going back to the program, IQ program. So now I want to create another action. In this case, it will be a shortcut key. So I'm going to click under the actions plus assign G2. And as you can see right here, G2 and record settings macro and before I do anything I need to click record macro so I'm going to click record macro and control J and stop recording that's it so over here I want to make sure that the only thing I have it's keyboard events selected I'm going to advanced settings action trigger on press and no repeat as you can see I only pressed once but uh, just control J and J control so I'll leave as it is like this so now back to Photoshop and I'm going to press G2 and I've got a duplicate layer I'll close that and if I keep on pressing adds a new layer and I can use this uh, as you can see I've got th four more macro keys that I can use to, to my advantage using Photoshop as you can see, it's super easy, super cool, and bear in mind one thing, a uh, gaming keyboard, it's not only for gaming, it can be used in Photoshop and other programs as well. That's it for now, thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe, share this video with everyone you know, and even to those you don't know. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time, bye for now.